G'day, Sam O here. Um, you'll have to excuse the lawnmower in the background, neighbours mowing, not much I can do about that. Um, what have we got? Sunday 27th of September 2015. Um, peppermint gum, which is a type of eucalyptus that's flowering in the area right now. So the bees are probably bringing in a little bit of pollen and a little bit of nectar from that. It doesn't really have a lot, but they'll still be bringing some in. Um, today's big job, I've got eight shallow supers and six deep supers I've got to put out on eight hives. This new hive, I've got to um, get into that and I've got to transfer that into an eight frame hive. Uh, next weekend I won't have a chance to do anything with the bees. I've got two markets on, on the weekend. And the weekend after that I've got markets as well. So today is pretty much my only chance. First up I'm going to work on this new hive. I'm also trying something new with this. I've got a um, base there and I've changed the shimmer around on it so that I'll have it working the other way. I'll show you what I mean as I get into it. Sort of reinventing the wheel here. Got my baseboard. This is the front where the landing pad normally is. I've got a bit of timber on now across there to close up what would be used for the entrance. And I've taken away some of the shim on this side. So what I'm doing there, I'm having the hive oriented the other way. The frames will be running this way. So the plan is when I'm inspecting this hive, it'll just pull a frame up here, I don't really have to reach over too much. Pull a frame over, pull a frame out, inspect it, put it to the side, drag the next one across. Now if you've seen other videos of mine, this was the new hive that barely made it through the winter. I'm just going to put the five frames in there to collect and bring a bit of pop, pollen in, a bit of nectar. A little bit of brood in this area. A little bit over this side as well. And that's about all there is. So I don't think I will put a super on them. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. They're still going to need time to build up. So we'll see how they get on with that configuration. Not trying to totally reinvent the wheel, just do things a little bit different. Might be a bit easier for me to manage the hive at least. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you in another video.